Is a smooth ride essentially possible if you design it for comfort? If you start with that goal in mind, you can reach a far more optimized design point. That is why it seems quite achievable, especially if Optimus, Tesla's humanoid robot, is involved. Imagine Optimus taking care of the car by cleaning it, doing light maintenance, and even handling automatic charging. Today on Amp Drive, we bring you two fresh and exciting updates about the Tesla Model 2. Yes, you heard that right. This is one of the first reasons we believe the Tesla Model 2 can actually reach the astonishing price point of $15,990. Elon Musk could surprise the world yet again by integrating the Tesla Bot Optimus into the Model 2's ecosystem, allowing it to handle tasks such as cleaning, maintenance, and automatic charging for the electric vehicle. And here's something even bigger, by the end of this year, the Tesla Model 2 might be the first Tesla to feature a sodium-ion battery. We are not claiming it will be better than the 4680 cell, but it will certainly be far cheaper than Tesla's current top batteries. Why? Because it is the first sodium battery in the world to perform on the same level as the best lithium batteries currently available. We are talking about an impressive 310 miles of range with only a 5-minute charge, plus a much lower risk of fire or explosion compared to lithium-ion batteries. So what exactly makes this battery so valuable for electric vehicles? And why would Tesla choose sodium for the Model 2 over the 4680 or LFP batteries? Before we go deeper, welcome to Amp Drive. If you are passionate about Tesla news, EV technology, and breakthroughs like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button right now. We are on an exciting journey together, and your support helps bring more amazing updates like this straight to you. Now, in just one minute, you are going to see never-before-seen footage of the Tesla Model 2 being tested with this groundbreaking battery technology. Not so long ago, critics and skeptics of electric cars would say they would not even consider buying one unless it could travel at least 300 miles on a single charge. Well, that milestone has been passed. Today's EVs can easily reach 400 to 500 miles thanks to breakthroughs in battery technology. But now the conversation has shifted to a new challenge, charging time. Now those same EV critics say they will not switch until an electric car can charge as quickly as filling up a fuel tank. The truth is, people will always find something to criticize. But if an EV can add 310 miles of range in just 5 minutes, there will be almost no excuse left to reject them. And yes, CATL, Tesla's largest battery partner, has developed what might be the most impressive battery ever created. It completely challenges the belief that lithium is irreplaceable, using sodium, which is 1,400 times more abundant than lithium. Recently, industry analysts have predicted that this battery could reshape the market and replace half of the LFP battery sector. That is remarkable, given that LFP is already one of the cheapest battery chemistries available. The specific model for the Tesla Model 2 is the CATL Naxtra EV Pack, which delivers an energy density of 175 Watt hours per kilogram. This is the highest among sodium ion batteries in the world and matches the performance of the LFP batteries Tesla uses in its mass market cars. This means the Model 2 can achieve around 500 km of range per charge with a lifespan exceeding 10,000 cycles, dramatically lowering maintenance costs over its lifetime. What most people do not realize is that reaching 175 watt hours per kilogram for sodium batteries and putting them into a production vehicle like the Model 2 is an enormous achievement. Typically, sodium ion batteries manage only around 130 to 150 watt hours per kilogram. The main reason is that sodium ions are larger than lithium ions, which makes arranging them in the battery structure more difficult. This either forces the cells to be larger or requires extra spacing, reducing the energy density. Additionally, sodium is heavier than lithium, which means sodium ion batteries weigh more for the same capacity, lowering the density per kilogram. Overcoming these challenges has taken decades of research and millions of hours of engineering around the globe. CATL has proven it has the solution, and the Tesla Model 2 will be the first real world example of this battery's commercial potential. 
while 175 watt-hours per kilogram still cannot match the 272 watt-hours per kilogram of Tesla's current 4680 batteries, CATL aims to eventually reach 200 watt-hours per kilogram. For now, the 175 mark is more than enough to revolutionize the affordable EV market. Even though its energy density is average compared to the very best, the Naxtra battery developed for the Tesla Model 2 can charge faster than almost any other battery on the market. A mere 5 minutes of charging can provide 310 miles, or nearly 500 kilometers, of range. This brings EV charging as close as possible to the experience of filling a fuel tank. The key lies in how quickly ions move between the electrodes during charging and discharging. In the Model 2's Naxtra battery, sodium ions travel between the anode and cathode through the electrolyte with remarkable speed. Thanks to the optimized ionic conductivity of sodium in the electrolyte, the ions move extremely fast, enabling the Model 2 to recover nearly its full range after just a brief stop at a charger. Do you believe the Tesla Model 2 will launch with this sodium ion battery? Share your guess in the comments, we are reading them all. But here is something that might shock you, the battery pack for the Tesla Model 2 has reportedly been priced at only $10 per kilowatt hour. Not $100, just $10. That is like going from buying a car to buying a bicycle. The secret is not some unknown chemistry but something as simple as salt, the same type you might find in your kitchen. While the industry has been working hard to bring battery costs below $100 per kilowatt hour, CATL claims the Naxtra battery, which could power the Model 2, can be made for just $10 per kilowatt hour. Back in 2008, lithium ion batteries cost as much as $1,415 per kilowatt hour. It took 16 years to bring that down to around $115 by 2024, the point at which EVs started competing seriously with gasoline powered cars. Now CATL has crushed that price by a factor of 9. If that price can be maintained, the implications go far beyond the Model 2, from home battery storage to backup systems for entire neighborhoods. Naxtra actually comes in two versions a 24 volt integrated start stop battery for heavy trucks and another for passenger EVs like the Model 2. Both use the same core technology but are tuned for their specific uses. Temperature performance is another major advantage of sodium ion technology. Both Naxtra versions can operate from minus 40 degrees Celsius to 70 degrees Celsius, far beyond typical lithium battery limits. Even in freezing Arctic weather, they keep 90% of their usable capacity. This is not just about keeping the Model 2 running in cold weather, it also makes electrification possible in some of the harshest climates on Earth. CATL also claims Naxtra can last more than 10,000 charge cycles. That is a huge leap over Tesla's current LFP batteries, which typically last 3,000 to 4,000 cycles before dropping below 80% capacity. With Naxtra's lifespan, a 363-mile range would still be strong after millions of miles of driving. This is no longer just a battery, it is energy infrastructure on wheels. How confident can we be that the Tesla Model 2 with a sodium-ion battery will be a smart choice? We will know for sure in November when the official launch and full specifications arrive, but early information points to at least 300 miles of range from a next-generation sodium-ion pack. What stands out is that Tesla plans to use only 53 kilowatt hours of capacity yet still exceed range expectations, showing how efficient this new system is. Two versions are expected, a standard range and a long range model. The latter will travel farther for a slightly higher price, ideal for drivers wanting fewer charging stops. Sodium ion packs are cheaper than today's lithium iron phosphate cells and a 53-kilowatt-hour sodium pack may cost about $2,000 less. Sodium is 300 to 500 times more common than lithium, making it easier to source and less likely to run out. High lithium battery costs also come from cobalt and nickel. Cobalt prices have been volatile due to supply risks and ethical concerns, while sodium costs only about $150 per ton and has a stable supply chain across several countries. Estimates suggest sodium ion batteries could cost as little as $10 per kilowatt hour compared to $100 for low-grade lithium iron phosphate cells. For Tesla, 
that could mean a battery pack cost of around $530 instead of more than $5,000. That saving, multiplied across millions of cars, becomes a major advantage. Sodium batteries are also easier to recycle and use a stable liquid electrolyte that reduces fire risks. They work from minus 20 degrees Celsius to 60 degrees Celsius, making them reliable in very hot or cold climates. Tests show they stay safe even when damaged. Tesla is aiming for a global launch in November 2025, with U.S. test drives in early 2026. The plan is to reach over 50 major cities quickly, focusing first on states like Florida and California where electric vehicle adoption is high. Production is set to begin in late 2025 at Fremont and Texas Gigafactories, targeting 50,000 units in 2026. Tesla will use modified Model 3 and Model Y lines to save over $1 billion and keep the price under $15,990. Initial deliveries will go to Florida and California in March 2026, then expand nationwide. Shorter wait times and a much lower price could make this the electric car many have been waiting for. Thank you for watching Amp Drive. Please like, share, and subscribe so you do not miss our next update. We have another video coming in just two days, and your support helps us keep bringing you the latest on electric vehicles.